So I found this old uh, radio magnetic indicator and I connected it to my digital to synchro converter. And when you enter in an angle on the uh, terminal window here, the RMI uh, compass card in the background moved to that angle. For some reason it's 120 degrees off. Um, but anyway, if it's sort of 120 degrees, the compass card is at zero degrees uh, due north. If I take it down to 90 degrees, it spins around to uh, 30 degrees, uh, 60 degrees goes to 60 degrees, and then uh, 30 degrees here goes to 90 degrees, or I believe that's uh, due east, and so on, all the way around the compass row. So now it'd be flying due south, um, and back to whatever that is. Um, just type in some random things here. I think one uh, practical application of this would be if you had a flight simulator and you wanted to display the output of the flight simulator on a real aircraft instrument, you could use a digital synchro converter uh, like this to do that. So if the uh, uh, flight simulator said you were flying uh, due north, it would output uh, due north on the digital to synchro converter and then the compass card of that radio magnetic indicator uh, would, would fly uh, due north like this. And of course, I'm, I'm not a pilot or an aviation geek, so I'm assuming that the compass card is the bearing that you're actually uh, traveling to here, so I might be wrong in that. But Anyway, I think it's pretty cool being able to control a, uh, a real piece of aircraft uh, uh, instrumentation from a, uh, you know, from a PC here from the terminal window. Anyway, thanks for watching. Bye.